Today we are going to begin a meditation practice known as Centering Prayer. The goal of Centering Prayer is to be able to let go of all of the conscious thoughts that are a distraction to paying attention to the presence of God in our lives and truly center ourselves on God. We begin this practice by selecting a sacred word. Select whatever means God to you. It might be the word God or love. Select your word and then you'll sit comfortably. Open your eyes enough so that you won't fall asleep but closed so that you aren't distracted by the things that are around you. And then, once you are seated comfortably, your eyes open, pay attention to your mind and your thoughts. A monk named Thomas Merton described the mind as a river, each thoughts being boats on that river, and for much of our lives, the river is congested with all sorts of traffic, all kinds of thoughts crowding out the space in our head. The goal of centering prayer is to let those thoughts, those boats float down the river until there is but one boat left, your sacred word. We do this by responding to any thought that comes up in our mind with the sacred word. When the thought comes up, we simply answer it with the sacred word and let the thought pass. And then when another thought comes, we answer it with the sacred word and allow it to pass until all that is left is the word. And then we have reached that place, we let go even of the word and rest in the presence of God. So now let us begin. Sit comfortable. Make your eyes open enough so that they can not be distracted by what is around you and yet not be tempted to fall asleep. Pay attention to your breathing. A deep breath in. Hold for a few seconds and then a deep breath out. And now take up your sacred word. into your breathing. Answer any thought with your sacred word and allow the thought to pass over and over again until all that's left is your word. When our time is finished, I will bring you back with the words of the Lord's Prayer.
our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.